We got a deer angry from 351 Cleveland. Yeah, I mean, this is great shit. Okay. <laughs> Check that out. Calm your ass down. Dear ABS, I came across something confusing as I was driving by a farm today, and I was hoping you could shed some light on it. I saw, out in the field, a cow with no less than five pink wieners. <laughs> what the hell? Hanging from a gigantic ball sack. <laughs> that's not a ball sack. That's, uh, that's an otter. <clears throat> I thought cows were supposed to be girls. According to my eighth grade substitute teacher, Mr. Hardpetter, although boys can also give a certain kind of milk, they are the only ones who have wieners. Angry, you seem to have extensive knowledge on such issues. You have no idea. He talks about wieners all the time. Dick, I've learned so much from your videos about shrimping blumpkins, deep fried pickles, Boston Red Sox, <laughs> and the Grover Cleveland nature more than I ever learned in Catholic school. They teach that in Catholic school? I'm converting. No, you're not. Um, my questions are as follows. One, he actually put numbers on these. Were those cows with wieners I saw? Two, if so, what does the bull do? Three, if not, do the bulls ever get as confused as I did. Four, can you and Gruber please give a demonstration? Mr. Hardpetter, Hardpetter illustrated what he was talking about with in-depth diagrams, handmade drawings, and glossy magazine photos, but never showed how. Although he said that was a demon he was struggling with, whatever that meant. Oh my God, what a sick bastard. I hope you can shed some light on this. Thank you for your help. 351 Cleveland. Well, first, I just want to let you know that the real problem with cows is that you're not the only person who gets confused. I have a friend who's a gay ball, and he totally started sucking on one of these wieners that you thought was a wiener, and he was liking it. And later when I actually told him that those weren't wieners, that was just a tit of a girl cow, he was all sexually confused again, just like you were. Well, I don't know if you were sexually confused, but you were definitely confused. Yeah, those were nipples. And that's not a ball sack, it's an udder. Not only that, now that I think of it, I wish that women had nipples that big. That would be hot. That was like a double F-sized tit. Wouldn't it be funny if cows had bras? Well, they have like... <laughs> One giant ball with multiple like strands. <laughs> you know, how the hell did that work? That's kind of weird. And why do they let cow nipples be shown on TV when they don't let women nipples be shown on TV? I don't know why they allow some of the cow taking a shit on TV when they don't let us take a shit on TV. Yeah, I mean, on the Discovery Channel, they show cows fucking balls. But we can't have sex on TV? Double standard! Why is it that women's milk tastes good and men's milk tastes salty? Even though getting it out is quite more enjoyable, I must say. I'm out of here. But again, 351 Cleveland, thank you for writing, and I really hope that you were joking, even though I know you weren't. 